Okay, let's try to do the word original here. So, let's look at the simplest possible way to combine them. So we've got O, R, I, G, I, N, A, and L. Original. Not bad in its original form. I kind of like the, the way it flows. Some words tend to flow better than others right off the bat. This one flows pretty good. So let's see what kind of double combinations we got. The first thing we can see down here is we can go A, L. We can add the L into the A. Um, the next thing we see is we can uh, put the I inside of the G if we liked, like so. Uh, what else do we have? Um, the I, N can be combined like so. Um, the I, G can be combined like so. Um, and O can be put inside of the R like so. Or the R can be put inside of the O like so. So if we start to use these combinations, what we got is we got O, R. Now that's hard when you start making things big to catch an O with an I. But we could combine them all. Origi Original. O, R, I, G, I, N, I, I, I doubled up the I, sorry, I made a mistake. O-R-I-G-I-N-A-L. Not bad, I kind of like that form, but let's, let's, tr let's see what else we can do with it. Let's make it look a little nicer here. So, we've got O-R-I-G. Now we have to go into an I. Now it, I, 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 I kind of gave myself a bad position here. I can't really put the eye inside, and putting it outside makes the eye quite wide. Um, I could put it outside, so let's follow around. So that kind of curls the other way. That actually looks very nice. I like that. O-R-I-G-I-N. And now we could take the A all the way off of there like that if we liked. Not bad, but I'm not a huge fan. That way, I prefer it kind of ending like so. It looks very symmetrical. And then we can just take the A-L off like that. There, that's probably m my new favorite original. What else can we do to it? Well, we could go O R I G I N A L. Original. Well, we can, what else can we do? It? Let's try make one more here. O R I G I N A L original. Three nice versions of the word original.